Yeah. Okay. So so I've been work so I've been writing Ruby stuff, and I'm trying to look up like more stuff about night vision to cause I'm cover to talk about the night vision segment. And I'm trying to look at like every possible different angle, like if you if it's possible to see a chameleon color shift in night vision or like the the. Well, no, I mean it wouldn't be a chameleon color shift. You'd be able to see an object. You'd be able to see like an object. Right, but I want I I'm try again. I'm trying to I'm trying to look at every possible perspective for the, for the sake of the argument. Um and it there's not a whole lot of information on on stuff like that. On the, anywhere I can the find. white, the the bright like beige wall. Well, that's would a, well, reflect well it's, a, it's like a wood wall. Like well, her wall, it's, her it's, it's the wood. color. It's the color of the wall that's important because it, it's right. reflecting. Yeah. The wall itself will reflect even more light than her body right. would. So she, she will been stand the same up. Color uh, as the wall if she wanted to blend in. No, that I dark. that I know. Yeah. I, um, but she wasn't. She was the color of the surrounding darkness, which isn't yeah, gonna help. You can you can see the contrast much sharper with yeah. with better night vision. So I'll right. give them. I, I can give them this in that regard because, like, yeah. even me as an author, I wouldn't have thought of that. I I wouldn't have have thought that, you know you thought about that necessarily. But I also mm -hmm. probably wouldn't have put this pairing in that sort of circumstance if that were the case. Because um, <laughs> yeah. I I probably would be like. Oh wait, night vision and chameleon. How does that work? And then just like yeah, oh, I know that that, 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 that that like is is that is that possible to like stuff to look up? Either that experiment has never been tried before, or the the results are not made readily available to the internet. We'll, we'll have to I ask. We'll nothing. have to ask a chameleon at some point. Cats. Well, no, I just thought like some asshole just pointed a video camera at a chameleon in the middle of the night with night vision. Like it's the in, in this day and age, someone had to have been curious. But apparently not. Cat, cats can hunt down mice at night, like, yeah. like in the grass. <laughs> like, like I mean, well, I know it's, mice can't change colors, so that that that. Um, okay, now here's a picture still... of a chameleon in night vision. Um, right. the question I have is, how do we know if it's colored or not? Yeah. I mean, night vision cameras are usually green anyway. So. Yeah, they are. But anyway, hi everyone. How's hi. it going? Welcome back to our, uh, our reaction series, uh, the double feature currently going on. Um, for those of you who are new, which, why are you joining in on episode 7? But welcome here. I'm Raymond. He's Tom. He's Fat Man. Actually, no, I'm sorry. Depending on how I pose the... <laughs> he's fat man he's tom no. uh as i'm nodding to their now, now, now you're screwed yeah i'm gonna flip my camera well 180 degrees ha ah, no i get to position it bitch <laughs> we've already done that joke my camera's gonna we did that joke back my in camera's episode gonna be four. upside down now <laughs> uh but yes uh today we are watching once again uh my hero uh academia season three episode seven uh, and uh Land of the Lustrous, hopefully season one, uh, episode four. Um, and then afterwards, Fat Man's going to have something for his channel that me and Tom <laughs> really aren't necessarily the most enthused for. Um, uh, wait, what is it exactly? I'm, I'm, uh, no, 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 don't, I'm don't. Being, it's a, don't no spoiler, spoiler questions. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm going to turn down my gain a little bit. Uh, I'm already bracing there myself. We go. <laughs> Testing. All right, there we go. Yeah. So it should be it should be fine. You'll survive. Don't okay. worry what about happened? it. Okay. Last episode we had the Tokoyami thing that got wrapped up pretty quickly. It, it was the so far yeah. it was probably the weakest episode of the bunch aside from episode one, which was again a recap. I mean we did we get we did get we did get Needle Girl. Yes, which we did. Was pretty we cool. did finally get Toga. Wait, aren't you thinking of two weeks ago? Two weeks hmm? ago, two, well, two, two weeks ago was when you checked out early. That was Gas Mask guy. Yeah. Really? Uh, yeah. Because last week's episode, the like, uh, Bakugo and Tokiyami got caught by, by yeah, that, that was magician week, yeah. guy. Yeah, which, which, yeah. which I thought we walked away from. We all kind of liked that episode. Really no, no, no we all. I, I, I'm just saying that I think overall, compared to the other episodes, it was the weakest thus far. Maybe I thought it was the best so far. Yeah, oh, really. <laughs> you, you uh, one thing. One thing I am gonna say about Tokiyami because I I just looked up the I looked up the English cast some more. Uh, Josh Greeley has fucking range. Like vocal wise. Wait, what is 
is who is that? Who's Josh Greeley again? Josh, Josh, Josh Greeley is Tokiyami. No, I mean, what, who does he play otherwise? He is Tyrion. Oh, geez. he is. Yep. Wow. <laughs> He's also Armin in Attack on Titan. So that's three different characters with three very distinct voices. He's got some fucking range, and I have to applaud that. That's uh, uh yeah, that's, 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 that's impressive. Yeah. Holy shit. Yeah. Although, uh, that, that is now, now every talent. time he says revelry in the dark, I'm just going to hear, the rose has thorns. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah. no, no, I'm not, I'm not going to hear if, that. If I have a time. vote for single worst line in all of Ruby, that's my vote. It's not that anything. That, that's up there. Important. It's not anything plot important, but it's just fucking painful, man. Yeah. Yeah. It's weird how <laughs> sh- like he gets really Shakespearean in those episodes. It's kind of yeah, weird. Yeah, that would. I mean, I mean, I think a worse line from that whole Tyrion. Uh, I mean, a, like a worse line from that whole Tyrion thing is Ruby's. Me. Yes. Okay. Yes. Uh, like, yes. I mean, that's that's. I mean, the this? rose has thorns is like cringe, cringy, but that that Ruby line is just well, bad. no, anyway, because let's because get... the Ruby thing, fine. Ruby has no character at this point, and that's how she responds. But his was in response to not even a burn. It was like a question. <laughs> it's it, like sure. like a genuinely legitimate question, and like yeah. it's like it was like it, it, it was like actually a barb. You? There was no actual, there was no actual like threat. There was no actual like 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 sarcasm or wittiness. It was literally just a bland question. And he was like, "Oh, she has thoughts. No, she doesn't. She asked a goddamn question." <laughs> I, I want to see the uh, the alternate universe version where Tyrion is a teacher, <laughs> and, and then like somebody's like, uh, so like the the derivative of a, 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 y equals m x plus b, and he's like, oh, the rose has thorns. <laughs> like, can go uh, along with your your Watts is the headmaster of Mistral now theory. Yeah, <laughs> actually, you know, I would. Yeah of Tyrion as a teacher. Like, what if that was his actual backstory? What if he used to be a teacher and he went crazy or something? He taught English. <laughs> he, <used> to... <laughs> he taught Shakespeare in English. He taught, yeah. No, that would be great. He taught yeah. He taught English until he lost his fucking mind. <laughs> that, that, that would have been great. That, okay. You know what? Yeah. All right. You know what? I'll, I'll buy that. That's, buy how that. You can, that's how you can redeem Tyrion. Somewhat. Yes. <laughs> I, will, I, will bu- I will buy that story if you put it in there. Um, but no, uh, no, last episode, like, I thought the second half was fantastic. The second half of the last episode was fantastic. The first half I thought was kind of weak because I thought they they had the Tokiyami Tokiyami stuff way too fast. Um, Yes, no, that 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 I think we were in agreement with. So like that's why I think over like the the overall best episode so far was the one where Deku went one million percent because that was a a nice steady build. Up to him unleashing one hundred one million percent on the fucking back. Yeah. Except that's the one I thought was the weakest. Oh really? <laughs> yeah, I, I, yeah, I think you did. Yeah. Yeah. Oh god, I don't know if I have a best right now. Um, I, I, uh, I don't know. Well, I'm also. I mean, they're, 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 they're hopefully, the thing is, hopefully this close. next episode will close. be even better than all of them put together. Well, now we're, well now it looks like we're taking on Dabby to- uh, Toka. To- what's the needle girl's name again? Toga. Um, Toga. Like, 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 Dabby, toga twice and just, just uh, whenever you picture her imagine her in a greek toga and then stop picturing her in a greek toga because you're a pervert and she's 14 <laughs> actually i don't is know she? how old she is i don't know how old wait she is. Wh- why would why would picturing someone in a toga like they're well, covered up i guess it depends <laughs> on the toga it depends on the toga now that i think about it because there are a couple stop. different there are a couple different designs for a toga yeah, I mean, most I think most like, some, are really, her in some are really formal. Some only have one. <laughs> Don't strap. picture her in anything at all. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, that came out wrong. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right, all right. Before this dive, uh, dives even further into, I mean, we're already not getting monetized for this. Let's dive into the episode, <laughs> shall we? Yes, yes. Let's do. All right, Let's everyone, dive up. in, shall we? All right, all right. Three, two, one, go. Perfectly legal streaming site. We're not doing that gag again. <laughs> uh, yeah, we're watching this on Funimation.com. Hmm. This guy is up there with my favorite uh, um, yeah. voices. 
So is yeah. um, oh, what was his name? I, I just posted Ken Williams. About him. Ken Williams said, is up he there. He says Ken Williams, yeah. And then there's also um, oh, what is it? <laughs> Billy Zane is a fantastic voice actor. Oh, I just beat my finger up. I accidentally snapped a uh, I snapped a thing off my pen and it fucked up my finger. Ow, that hurt. The prestigious school that turned out some of the world's. But yeah, no. Um, let's see. Darren DePaul is also another fantastic voice actor. Um, Darren DePaul, that's um, Reinhardt in Overwatch, I think. Yes, it is. Yeah. He plays um, Arden Azunia from Final Fantasy XV, and he plays Samuel Hayden from the new Doom game. Both of which. The new Doom are... game? 2016. Doom 2016. Huh. Yeah. Um, Samuel Hayden is fucking. Like, like, his voice is fucking terrifying. Just, like, it's that calm, calculated voice of... You don't understand the work we're doing here. It's important to keep all of humanity alive. We need the hell energy. If we don't have it, we all suffer. So work with me. Like, like his voice is just, like, so smooth, and it has that nice guttural... Like that, yeah. Um... And then he does Arden Azunia, who's this very nice, fanciful British-sounding folk who goes around in kind of a pompous demeanor. And when things get serious, he gets menacing. It's like like he he knows how to do those roles perfectly. So it's him, Kent Williams, and um, Billy Zane, who played Ansem in Kingdom Hearts One. I mean, I think I think Billy Zane goes with needs no introduction. Yeah, Billy Zane is is just the fucking man. Like, so I was just like doing like collection of who are my favorite villains and who voiced them, because like that yeah. is so key to me, is well voiced villains. Yeah, no, that is a good thing. I just like I just like looking at voice actors in general. What a twist! No, you don't say. many fighters as possible you can't seriously want to face the bad guy Ada gets it even for self-defense he meant the students in the woods hmm. is that the door i guess mr aizawa is back already finally oh no wait the... it's daddy Everyone, get back! wait i thought he was in the woods when did he yeah, what? How? What's the lineup here? No way! That's the guy who got screamed earlier. Yeah. Blood control, so strong. Just as I'd expected. Oh wow. You. Blood control. <laughs> That's awesome. Hemokinesis. I love it. Are you sure about that? You've already been defeated, regardless of what happens to me. The two most trusted pillars of the UA, the pinnacle of hero education, and All Might, the symbol of peace. Hmm? Damaged Leroy's trust in you both. Sloppy management keeps allowing villains to slip in. You know, they've almost lost all faith in you. Imagine how they'll react when they find out you let a student get. Not gonna happen! Not our classmates! Not while we're here! Don't be naive. It only took. Who's to start picking you off? That's enough! <laughs> well, the pros separated them. <laughs> <laughs> this guy's just trying to provoke you. He won't talk. Uh, Mr. Aizawa, I think you got him. I fought one before. Uh... It must be a villain's quirk. <laughs> It's like the elevator scene from Drive. I left to direct our defense, but I ended up taking care of Coda. Look after him while I go back to the front line. If that flies, we hardly know anything about them. You'll be just fine by yourself. The other co I think they're strapped. But Coda does have a quirk. Fighters here to keep our attention since we are the pros. That's mm. them out there. 
If there aren't many, then we should be fighting too. Yes. There's only like two left too. No, three. After the students, know about Baku. You are might be targeting others as well. Burn? They're after the cool students. Yeah. Making sure you students are protected. They're after the top billing. <laughs> Meanwhile, back at the ranch. <laughs> they're Ooh. after the people who don't get relegated to group shots in the OP. Oh shit, I didn't realize that they wrapped his arms like I forgot about that. Why do you think she ripped her shirt off? I I, I, I in the I, last it just, episode. It my mind. It has been a week since we watched it. <laughs> Too hot. That was a ice. One of them always says the truth, and one of them always lies. I mean, that's at least that's what I I assumed yeah. back your last episode, because he always said like this, the something and then the opposite of it. Oh, interesting. Whoa. Yeah, that's a little bit of an understatement. I-I-I like that weapon. Yeah. Ooh, I like this guy. Punch him. You, you remember this guy? Kill him. You guys can kill him now. He'll be fine. Hold on. We're not leaving without the kid. Don't worry. Pockets that I thought I'd let them grow. But allow me to explain a basic tenet of math. It's because there's something else I don't want you to see. <laughs> this guy's good. Is that my ice? That's right. <sighs> During the and into my right pocket. Damn it! His quirk lets him compress and hold things. <laughs> okay, thanks, Deku. <laughs> He's good at magic. Oh, oh my god! Yeah! <laughs> he did it! <laughs> Holy shit! Redemption! <laughs> Good job, guy! <laughs> oh, shit. Uh, you have ice powers! Use your ice powers, damn it! Isn't that a tragedy? Poor little Shoto Todoroki. Uh oh. They got Todoroki still. Oh no, they got Taroki. Oh. Kata, no! Whoa. He, he. So it was how you guys said. It wasn't how I predicted. Yeah, yeah. He's... What did I say again? You said I, I I thought they were gonna rescue Bakugo oh, yeah. and keep uh no, I, Tokiyomi. Yeah. You guys said the other way around. Yeah. yeah. So we're it we're done now. That we've done it. We've Yeah. Just leave him. He, who cares? <laughs> oh shit. Oh god. 
Oh. Oh no. Oh fuck, Ragdoll. Yeah. They we, actually we they literally did kill knew her. you Shit. for one episode. Yeah, I was expecting she was gonna do a lot more. I mean, he still did a lot of damage to him, let's be fair. I mean, did... How many of them managed to escape, and how many did you capture because of this? I don't know. It's it looks like... Question. I mean, they, they they killed one and captured one, right? No, they captured a few, I thought. Ambulances and firefighters arrived. Well, barely than ever, I guess. Due to the gas... Dead? Oh, shit. Were injured. <laughs> Thirteen were unharmed. She did nothing. But it was apparent that she'd lost a lot of blood. Oh, they got muscular. Were caught and arrested. The other attackers. Oh, that's gas mask guy. His name is Mustard. Oh, I okay, guess so that makes got sense. The, like mustard gas. So they got the so they got the two cool ones. That's gonna have, yeah, that's gonna have some heavy. When are you going to open the gate? He's sketching a schedule statement from UA administration. Has anyone been in contact with the families of the children you've allowed to be in danger? Allowed? A oh, fucking wow. loud? <laughs> that is a radically. Irony is shame to me. We knew the league would resurface, but we lacked a fundamental. Aim to destroy hero society, and they've already started their war. But what did this attempt? Their hey, it's winter. We didn't even know they possessed. The sun. We're all rusty. We've definitely gotten complacent during peaceful times without realizing it. I get sweet life for good. I will never forgive myself for such cowardly ignorance while I was. A relaxing soak in the bath. We shouldn't have had this force. We want to be Does sure he blow? still strong. To have us duty kidnapped as our greatest failure is cheap. Have to find these faithful heroes away from us. I agree. Every news outlet is currently. That's Steve Bloom, right? I think so. Part it's, it's likely because the villains notice his violent tendencies during the sports festival broadcast. Will be the end of UA as a school. This is going exactly as I thought it would. Tropical trust. There's some this point we can't deny it anymore, can we? There's a traitor at this school. The training camp was being. Don't you think that's a little suspicious? I guess a kid could have used their phone. Problem. We have to find who the leak is. Could be you, for all we know. You got any proof that? Everyone in this room is an ally. Uh, uh, we start doubting. No. We'll destroy our Traitor isn't something we should take lightly. At the very least. Oh, it's gonna bother me. Sitting at this table. The view that I am innocent. For the moment, what we must do as a school. Is so I, I need to point out that uh, apparently the headmaster is a hamster. This yes. Is a time to implement something I've wanted to With a scar. He is. He is horrifying. Yeah, he's. I mean, you're you ha you're not caught up yet, now are you? Yeah, he's he's not a human with an animal quirk. He's an animal with an intelligence quirk. Oh, really? Okay. Is that how they phrase it? Really? Yep. Oh. Yeah, yeah. He's he's a he's an actual animal whose quirk is super intelligence. Damn, that's like, interesting. They said that in the uh, final exams from uh, season two. Wait, hold on. What's gonna happen now? What is it? We finally finished taking comprehensive statements from Aizawa oh. and Lex. Hmm. Let's call the 
although we have a lead on where the League of Villains are hiding. <gasps> really? About two weeks ago, I sent an officer around to gather information. A bystander pointed out that he... ...thing that was supposed to be vacant. The man looked to be in his 20s, but we couldn't find any plausible... Ma we spoke with the owner of the building, though, and found that there is a sort of hidden bar there. My man... ...been investigating further. A hidden bar and you decided it wasn't related to a kidnapping case? I mean... <clears throat> Like tax free speakeasies. I guess. Heroes for this rescue and inevitable cleanup mission. All might sleep. Dun dun. I is there a reason that he doesn't give his cork to like more than one person? I think it's like I don't think he can. I what I think is happening I is that. It slowly transfers from one host to the next. I don't like. I think he is getting weaker, and more of that power is being given to Deku. Well, every time that he's mentioned how weak he's gotten, it's because he like exerted himself too much. Ah, uh, but he actually like he's gotten somewhat weaker from exertion. But the uh, wait, what? he said. I mean, back in season one, like. You know, like episode like four or five or whatever. He said that he was. We'll discuss that later. I'm so grateful to the medium for all the free publicity. Yeah, that's what Trump says. I mean, this is legitimately like good Ruby. Yeah, yeah. This is what much. what Ruby like wanted to be. Yeah. After the incident, or I guess should have been. I mean, you literally punched until there was no bone left. The cop showed up too, apparently. Uh. <laughs> how, what the fuck? how are you supposed to eat that? When you wake up, please eat this and call me. Wait. Oh! Oh, Mrs. Deku! Fuck. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> I'm dead. How is he supposed to eat that? <laughs> he doesn't have hands. Hey, Midoriya, good, you're finally awake. Did you see the news? Reporters are... Last time... I brought a present. I made it from all of us. It's a melon. What? <laughs> Please, Sir keep this to himself. Did everyone from Class A come to visit? No. Out. They were knocked unconscious huh? from that villain's poisonous gas. Oh. And Yayorozu took a pretty. Was that Earjack and yeah, had Invisible Girl? Yesterday. Yeah. Okay. But, us, well, well, who got hit in the head? He, the, Mo got no, hit who, in the were, head. who were still knocked out. Yeah. It's Headphone Jack and Invisible Girl. Yeah. You know it's Todoroki. Now you could take that one of two ways, and I like that. I like how they delivered that. I know you want to. Which is why. But it was supposed to be meant to be something. I had to. The entire reason I had my court. Said to me. Just to save Bakugo, or I think it's supposed to be everyone. <laughs> Just to save Bakugo. Yeah. Only Bakugo. I wouldn't move if I couldn't save someone who was right in front of me. Poor guy. He's gone. All right, then let's go get him. <laughs> and so is Todoroki. <laughs> Why are you at the hospital? I couldn't just sit at home, so I figured I would come here. We were on our way to visit you, and we saw All Might and some police officers. 
With the assistance of Alicent from Class B, I attached a tracking device to one of the villains. Oh, yeah. Creation that will receive that signal. I hope it helps your search. Previous. Confidence and judgment needed to make quick decisions. But well, look how much you've grown. You have. Classmate's still in danger. Give her a head pat. Frustrating that I can't <laughs> <laughs> this girl wait. needs a head pat. <laughs> Maybe wait. Please don't worry. You can leave the rest to. Damn it! Give her a head pat. Wait till the bandage is off. Head pats are gentle. <laughs> it's from All Might. <laughs> He's gentle. <laughs> Just ask Deku's mother. Oh. What? P people ship yeah. him and Deku's mother. <laughs> Have they ever interacted? That's a good question. I said we have to leave this to the professionals. It's not the right time for us to get involved. Idiot! I couldn't do anything. I heard my friend was targeted, and I just stood by. <laughs> supposed to call myself a hero or a man Hiroshima calm down play for this dude yeah and what Ida said is true <laughs> all of you I know what you're saying what if he turns villain but still that'd be crazy on, Midoriya. take my hand um <laughs> <laughs> to put the like like the the, the bandage stump in his Oh fuck you for running it there. Oh god damn. <laughs> oh god, you know what? You know what? Earlier we said that I was saying that I don't think I have a favorite. I think this is my favorite. Yeah, this this is great. This is I think this episode. just took favorite. That was fantastic. That was a fantastic episode. It does raise the question of why Deku didn't go 100% on his legs to save Bakugo, but like him freezing up that makes sense. That makes complete yeah. sense. Also, like, how much, how well, how well do you think he was really thinking at that point, considering how much pain he had to have been in? Oh yeah, no, I, I don't put it past him. Like, like, yeah. there's a logical solution yeah, yeah, yeah. to the problem, but at the same time, in that situation, you're not thinking logically. I'm, I mean, if you were down two arms, would you also want to go down two legs? Well, like, my <laughs> yeah, thought on the matter, if if he were able to think clearly, my thought on the matter is use one leg to kick off towards Dobby and Bakugo and. Then use the other leg to kick Dobby while grabbing, while, while all, looping if, your if arm around. Wouldn't he have just gone? Wouldn't if he all, have just gone into the portal faster if he kicked him that way? If all else fails, he could have just bit his ankles. Well, he, <laughs> no, he would like put himself between <laughs> Dobby and Bakugo and then kick. Yeah. So Dobby would go flying into the portal and he would be pushing himself and Bakugo out. <laughs> I want to see him like like him like Matt. use all for one to bite. <laughs> <laughs> so okay, so so wait, is Ragdoll dead? Like they were they were a little bit vague on She's that. missing. She's, She's missing, missing and they know that she lost okay. a lot of blood. <laughs> okay. We found most of her. Now just no skin. There's two ways that could go. She's either dead or the traitor. Or, I mean, okay, the third way could go is she's she's been captured, but I don't know why we I were. I would say I mean she seems mm, actually the, the least suspecting one would be a good traitor. Um, well, I'm gonna I'm, I'm gonna go with captured the, the because weird thing it for feels me, weird that you only get her for like five seconds and you don't really see her do anything. I, I mean, it seems weird that if they did kill her, that they wouldn't like capitalize on that by being like she's dead. Also, it seemed yeah. also when they announced her, like it seemed like they were making that a pretty big deal. Well, that's why those, that's those where tweets. I'm thinking because I, I saw a friend that was like she's here and showed a picture of her and i'm like that's kind of a weird reaction so what yeah. about this you yeah know, exactly this character yeah. becomes important so my question my, my theory is she's the traitor that that's why she's a big deal in the community because yeah. i know for a while everyone thought that denki electric guy they thought that he was the traitor yeah because they oh, had, shit. they had some very interesting thoughts on that because like well they never did find the guy oh you're right you haven't seen the first season so i'm not gonna ah Damn it. I'll get there. Every time I think I'm going to have a better week to be able to watch shit, it turns out to be worse than and more stressful than the week before. Yeah, and, uh, and you're still so. catching up on Darling. 
almost I, I, you know honestly darling might end up getting dropped at some point i don't oh, know really it, i don't know yet it depends on how these next couple episodes go how many episodes are is you darling the show was, where they like fuck in the mech suits kind of pretty much yes, uh, yes. I, I i was gonna do episode nine but my internet went to shit on tuesday and i never got around to it uh yeah so. you're basically through what are arguably the worst episodes so okay. the, the i mean no no it's a, it's 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 not that I consider it if it's bad. It's just it depends because I'm expecting this show to go full Ava at any moment. So it hasn't yet. We're on like episode seventeen. Uh, okay, I, I'll we'll see. I'll see how it goes. I'll see how it goes. Um, but yeah, no, I I do I do desperately need to get back to my hero because there's so much good shit there and I need to watch it. But okay, so back to your question about All Might, Fat Man. I think mm. the problem with, like, I think what's happening to All Might is twofold. I think before he transferred his powers to Deku, it was it was his injury that was holding him back most. But I think even, I think after transferring his powers to Deku, even without exerting himself anymore, uh, uh, his powers have been degrading. Because, like, it just seems like some of the things he said throughout Season 1 and Season 2 have indicated to me that he's he's slowly losing his power and... Like, the fact that Deku said he wanted to stand besides All Might, and All Might seems chagrin at that, it's either telling me that All Might is is going to lose his powers, or All Might is considering that he's already going to die. So... See, I think it's more likely the second one. I think that it's more likely that All Might knows that he's dying from his injury. Yeah. I, I, I think that's more... Because... I mean, I would I would be inclined to believe you more if every like downgrade in his power wasn't preceded by him doing something crazy and exertive. Yeah. I see I kind of have spoilers to go off of, so I can't tell you where Oh, yeah, of course, but like so is so they're, they're just they're just you, setting commenters. it up as like <laughs> I go speculating about anything and and they're immediately like, "Oh yeah, no, this happens." And I'm like, Shut the fuck up! Yeah, don't read the comments. Yeah. Don't don't, don't Come, read guys. the comments when they're spoilers. Okay, no, like, I, I, we can say that this. all Come we want that we don't want spoilers in the comments, but nobody listens. Commenters, please. We talked about this like four episodes ago. Manga oh. is over here. The show yeah. is right here. Well, I mean, to be fair, like this was back on my 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 video comparing Little Witch, uh, 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 my hero, and Ruby. Oh. So yeah, um, yeah. Okay. That makes sense. It was either that or back on my my flaws of My Hero Academia, because there was a direct wrestle of this issue with All Might. Um, all the same, um, the so this episode was fantastic. Let's run through. Yeah, it really was. Um, a lot of clever things. Aoyami, Aoyami, Aoyami. I don't know how to pronounce his name exactly. Fucking proves himself. He actually does something worth a damn. Oh, is that na- is that naval laser? Na- naval laser. He okay. Yeah. Shoot. No. Was yeah. Dude. That was a, that was a great. Not only did he shoot comeback. a guy, he shoots a dude in the fucking face. Damn. Yeah, that's that's gotta hurt. That's gotta hurt, man. So I mean, you know, it's it's whatever you can do. It's even the most insignificant. Like yeah, I was just gonna say, even can... the little thing, even every little thing helps. Timing, timing, timing. I like that. I I mean, I like that the the losers are are being good. Yeah. And it's not just like, oh, we need the the the, the guys from the from the OP. <laughs> oh yeah, no, the the, the 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 oh the multi arm guy. I can't remember his name for the life of me. He's really come into his I own this se- the, the last two episodes. Um, yeah. Well, yeah, because like they're supposed to be heroes. They're not supposed to be like the fucking like they're yeah. they're, they're they're all in class A. Just because the story is like, oh no, look at Deku and Bakugo and and Half Hot. You know, it's like. They're all in. They're all like class A heroes, right? Or class A heroes in training. Yeah, no. And it's actually treating them like that. They're they're being smart. Yeah, yeah. They're doing hero I, things. I, I think that deserves applause. Uh, yeah, it's it's like, it's like they're they're doing a really good job of making us give a shit about everyone. Yeah. So that when they like and, when they're like, oh, who. Who are they going to kill? They're obviously not going to kill, you know, these guys because they're the main characters. But it's like, shit, 
all of like the the s- secondary characters are like these likable, fully realized people, and we don't want to see any of them die, even though they're like the expendable B cast. And especially with a cast this large, that's impressive. Even the B class heroes, I'm like, I like the ones that have screen time. Yeah, it's 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 it is impressive how well written these characters are, at least or. I mean, like, here's the thing. I don't know how deep these characters actually are. Like, I haven't really sat down to consider it. I don't know if they're, like, any kind of super deep. But they're all enjoyable. And that's a very interesting distinction to make where people are like, oh, these characters maybe are are, are all shallow. And it's like, they might be shallow, but they're enjoyable. Like, they, 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 yeah. they, they, they on the surface, their personalities are warm. They're inviting. They, they, like, like. Even the ones there, that, there's enough there that you're invested in them. Yes, yes, and that's that's yeah. all you really need for a story like yeah. this. Like you, you, you can you can have your Evangelions where every single character is just like literal pathos in a can. <laughs> yeah, but you don't need that to make a good story. Sometimes you just need a, an, an entertaining character, just just someone who's yeah. generally likable and can do cool things. Um. Now, if you want it, like, this show is really good at keeping adding things to the characters as they go along. Like, that moment with Bakugo, where he said, stay away, Deku. And, like, it was, yeah. it was a plea. It was a plea. Uh, oh, that's, that, that's, that's, that's normal. <laughs> that, that's Bakugo in a nutshell right there. No, no, because. Don't save me. Don't save me, bro. No, no, I, I, because you can, you can see it as twofold. You could see it that way. Or you could see because that he it, doesn't want them to capture him because yeah. he knows he's better and it's it's character. I don't know. I thought that was well, no, like, no, not better, but because it was it was it, it, it's he's his friend. Like, like like I think in the end, Bakugo yeah. does consider Deku a friend. I think he just is an asshole. I think he that. considers him a friend right now. I just think that he's like, oh, God, he's better than me. Uh, I'm gonna be Sendure to him because none of the girls are Sendures. <laughs> but I think this is like the first openly like like. If you were to interpret it as him caring for Deku and not wanting to see Deku get injured or hurt or, or tied up in the mess where he's getting dragged into, this is the first instance that he's been kind to Deku that I can recall. Yeah. Like, that is a major moment of when the chips are down, this is the first moment that he's like, Deku, don't get hurt. <laughs> um, uh, yeah, but I mean, he's he's Sindare. Yeah, yeah. But like that's, it's Sundari done surprising. right. It's done right. Like like it's it's just ah, it's good. That's what I'm trying to say. It's fucking good. I found it entertaining. Yeah. I found it enjoyable. And it, it yeah, it's well, consistent. It's, it's, the, it's all, growth. Uh, Even if it's stereotypical growth, it's growth nonetheless. Oh. Uh, I don't think it's growth. I just think he's it I think it's just always how he's been. I mean, no, no, it's not always how he's been because he never would admit, he would never tell Deku to stay away. Well, mm, ah, fuck. But like, the, we can go back and forth on this the, all day. The, the, it's never been, it's never been like that. Like he's never been in any real danger. Precisely. Like this is the okay. Maybe it's not character growth. So it's it, not growth. It's reestablishment. <laughs> it's new establishment. Yes. That, okay. That's yeah. Go, it's going. My, it's my it's my pet peeve of getting growth and establishment wrong. You should have said that. I would have clarified the situation immediately. Oh, it's uh, yeah. I guess it would have. Okay. Um. So we have the 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 kids all lining up to fucking go on the rampage. Uh. But like um Bak- or not Bakugo, um Deku and what's what's Half Hot's name? Todoroki. 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 Yeah, like they've already been chewed out for heroing before they're graduated. So like what are they going to oh, do? Yeah, and um and uh, what's his face? Um Spoilers, Tom. Spoilers. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and um Ida, Ida as well. He was he was involved in that as well. Um, so mm-hmm. Ida, especially like him arguing against that was very fitting. Um, the, uh, uh, what's his name? Who is the guy who, who can harden himself? Um, red, red hair guy. Yeah. Red yeah. hair guy. I might cosplay uh, him at some point if I get abs. Um, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We're, get fit cosplay. <laughs> 
I, profit. I, hey, you know, he's, Liter- he's a, literally, that's probably the best way to make money. He, 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 is, he is a <laughs> get fit and cosplay. He is a yeah. popular, co- he is a popular character in the show. Downside, he is often shipped with Bakugo. So basically, him? yeah. Really? Yes, him and Bakugo are considered a a top tier ship. Really? Is there any like backup to that? Like uh, he's the best friend of like in the back. If you notice in the background, they interact a whole lot, and they do. Yeah, oh. like ever, especially Maybe especially just... since the sports festival where uh, he was like, "Hey, listen, I can withstand your power using my power," and like like they actually have synergy to their powers. Um, huh. So that they, they oh. like oh. that's the reason he's being so vehement is that Bakugo is his best friend. That's sort of a no. That's uh, uh, that's that's cool. Yeah. So yeah. like, um, so like you made uh, top tier ships. Let me try and think. Uh, you've got obviously <laughs> Deku Uraka. You've got um, Todoroki and Momo. You've got um, Bakugo and him. You've got Denki and Jiro, who's headphone girl. Um, who else do we got? Which one's Denki again? Denki is electric oh, dude. I'm blanking. Um, okay. You've got. God. Invisible. What uh, you've got? That's that's the worst possible tier ship. <laughs> what Denki and Momo? I, I'm Denki talking Denki tier as in popularity. Jack? I'm not talking about. Uh, I'm not talking about actual. Uh, well, okay. I I guess all all ships are worst tier ships if you're talking about quality. But oh, okay. Oh, that's fighting words. Um, <laughs> uh, do we want to move on to illustrious soon? Yeah, or? let's go to land of the illustrious. <laughs> yeah. Or do you want to keep fighting about ships? All right. Uh, all right. Time that. All right. Uh, I will I got the right. link. There we go. I will uh, post it to you guys. But no, uh, I'm trying to think what other ships. Uh, Tail Guy and Invisible Girl is a very popular one. Why? Um, because they were would, paired together ever so briefly. Um, it's actually, they, they have a really cute comic on it. Um, let me pull that up. Uh, um, alrighty, all right. alrighty. Snail let, time. Snail Did you time. see the picture I put in um, I put in the South Pole a while ago? Uh, the uh, picture or the video? The picture, the South Pole. Of ba- Miss Mountain? It was... It was uh no the south the south in the tundra oh not, okay um, not, it was um picture of her with a uh, with an actual bra on. oh yeah i saw that oh yeah 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 i, I yeah i we posted that like yes okay okay all right all right but no back okay let's actually right. get to jose no Kuni now shall we it, everyone load it up yep all right let's do this three all right. two one go. For the record, when we're done with this oh. and we're still in my hero academia, we're watching one episode of Strike, which is just to see what happens to Tom. <laughs> just to, just, just to make Tom mad. I didn't hate Strike, which is. I I thought it was boring. Oh, it was definitely boring. <laughs> It'll send a, It'll just send a signal through my head, and I'll just go out and beat the shit out of whoever's passing by the house first. <laughs> Man, Romero's getting creative with his next zombie movie. Duh! <laughs> uh. A dream. A dream was. That's what I like. That's what I often say whenever I dream. (laughs) That was so. That was so reckless. I I take it that he doesn't dream often, and that's why. (laughs) No, I mean it's just some cryptic, some cryptic shit for him to say. It's like uh, it's like uh, uh, Game of Thrones and the Three-Eyed Raven. Look at that pure child's happy face. And now it's not so happy. It is in pieces. I'm all about that base. D- You're all about that Bort. That's what you are about. <laughs> You're just going to enjoy that name the entire time, aren't you, Fatman? 
Yes. Wait, enjoy the what? The name Bort. <laughs> Bort. Oh yeah. That's like that, that's Bort. like a plus. That's like a plus four to this show. <laughs> <laughs> I still think it sounds like something Pinky the Rat would say. Bort. That, that's that's Zort. And Traz. No, it, yeah, but it sounds like something he would say. Yeah. Yeah. Pinky, what is Traz? It's Zort backwards, brain. <laughs> <laughs> Are you thinking right. what I'm thinking? I think so, Brain, but aren't we already naked? <laughs> <laughs> I love that. Oh. The weird thing is that wouldn't sound out of place in a in a Pinky in the Brain cartoon. That, probably... that was from a Pinky in the Brain cartoon. Oh, wait, that was an actual line? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> uh. Sensei, some weird shit has happened. Okay. That's so. Foss can talk to a snail now. <laughs> There's your head, Pat Raymond. There's your head, Pat. You need it for Momo. Although this is kind of like Momo, so. Bort. <laughs> <laughs> He just loves his head pads. He is the head pat master. I mean, Foss was a snail for like four hours. But <laughs> other than that, yeah, no, it was fun. I'm gonna name you <laughs> Phil. <laughs> <laughs> Did she just kill it? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, that would have been a, a conclusion to last week's episode if I ever saw one. Yeah. <laughs> If this gets an English dub, I'm trying to figure out who's going to voice Phil the Snail. It's a good question. Michael Jones. For some reason, Erica Mendez is the first one I think of, but that might just be because she's Puck and Rezero right now. No, no. Billy Zane. <laughs> <laughs> They already thought you were crazy, honey. <laughs> Nothing new. Oh my, what a predicament. <laughs> they understand much, you understand little. <laughs> Who just said that in English? Uh, the snail, I think. Oh. So is this just gonna be the show now? The snail's gonna like hit on everybody? Cinnabar <laughs> <laughs> wants the bone, you honey. Like hardcore Sundari shit. <laughs> saying that Bakugou. Which I'm all about, so I mean, we're, go for we're, it. We're saying that Bakugo has nothing on her. Yeah. <laughs> I'm expecting someone to just run by and give her ass a big slap. <laughs> I could imagine that happens a lot in this world. Probably. Well, she doesn't really talk to anyone, so... And I can't turn into a snail again. Why would you just walk up to someone and say that? <laughs> ah, shit. Ah! Poor snail. <laughs> Hi, I'm Phil. 
<laughs> oh, come on. It's the doctor's fault. It's not your fault. It's that well, I mean, why? Is, he, is she going to blame the doctor? I blame the doctor. Fuck the doctor. Oh, yeah, but is the is the headmaster going to believe that the doctor did it? Probably. Fuck the bitches. <laughs> I go both ways. See, now you have two things that only you can do. Who told you that name? ゆうがいかもしれませんが、とても優秀です。無能な僕を二度も助けてくれました。許せ。私は未だ解決を求めていない。俺の見回りはあの子は自分で考えたものだ。許せ。I mean, head back. Kinda. Yeah. Wise, maybe kind. Eh. What? She did kind of separate herself not to kill anyone by accident. Yeah. Yeah. I forgot how pretty the music in this show was. How does rock hair blow in the wind? I, I um, nom, 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 nom. Magic. Dude, this grass is awesome. <laughs> has five I'm gonna leaves. have way too much fun with the snail. I'm gonna have way too much fun with the snail. Uh. <laughs> Did she also turn to a snail? <笑>あ、この形まりって言い使ってる。探求。こう。すごい。原始されてるけど、ま、どうせ役立たずだし。So you're going to do the opposite of what the headmaster just told you to do. Okay. She wouldn't be an anime protagonist if she didn't. Yeah. That's Ozpin's game. He's telling Ruby to do all this dangerous shit on the off chance she does the opposite. Dun dun. <laughs> Did jellyfish eat paper? Jellyfish eat? Where are their mouths? I am not a jellyfish knowledge person. I, I, I think jellyfish mostly just like... Uh, I don't know. Do they eat like kelp or something? Hmm. Plankton? I don't know. I don't know what jellyfish eat. Let us know in the comments what jellyfish eat, kids. <laughs> Did they, did they eat peanut butter? <laughs> I love how none of us are commenting on the fact that the rock is naked. I mean, well, it's a rock. It's, it's yeah. yeah it is. <laughs> I'd li I'd like to think myself above such <laughs> petty fancies of of. Uh... <laughs> On the scale of on the scale of 
I mean, she's. I mean, she. Re she's really getting her rocks off, you know. <laughs> but I'm Tish. そう。やっぱここの膨らみ、もう少し<笑> I'm farting. この丘のものはあんま栄養ないようだな。そっか、動物は光だけじゃダメなんだ。食べるもね。That's <laughs> a new replacement Food for survive on bread alone. <laughs> you need food or whatever. おっとね、落ちた。やっぱ体力ないの。紛らわしいな。死ぬってやつ。ものの実は死ぬって聞いてきてないんだ。死ってどういうもの?I how does a rock know? I want a rock! Rock! Rock。本当はな。ちょっと故郷の様子が見たかったんじゃ。二度。近づくとそのことばかり考えてしまう。どれだけ威張る荒れ果てる。今気になるのはこれ。うん。本当にいいのか。仕方ないだろう。目の前のことから始めろ。大事だけど。オウム。一人じゃ無理だろ。Okay, okay, that wooden bowl sank. Uh, it is a filled wooden bowl. Filled with gold? <laughs> More water. I don't know. I don't know. Wood is still pretty... Pretty buoyant. It would have to be really dense. Wait. <laughs> did she, wait, hold on. Did she just walk into the ocean and find a mermaid? No. Wait. I think that's the snail. Yep. Oh, fuck. Did I say Phil? I meant Philomena. <laughs> that was some boob physics. Yep. Yes, it was. <laughs> <laughs> so 
So you went from a giant snail to a tiny snail to a hot babe. <laughs> You know that kid you made fun of in grade school? This is her now. <laughs> Don't. Th I mean, I mean, the other rock girl was covering up when the. Uh, when the red-haired rock girl came in, yeah. like, I think some things just transcend. It's a ball. But she, but if it, that was the case, okay. then rocks would understand what boobs are. It's, I mean, a, right? Why would you cover up if you didn't understand what boobs were? Okay, Tom, it's a wooden bowl yeah. that sinks underwater. It's important. Okay. Okay.。<laughs> I've heard of those. <laughs> Humans? Soul, flesh, and bone. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> アドミラビリスはその牛の肉だと伝えられていて、生殖と。と重ね紡ぐ特性を受け継いだとされて、一方骨が長い時を渡るすでは身につき陸に戻った。それって。大来者。どこまでがわからない。でも僕たちの成り
Oh shit! That fucking snail. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right. What did you just this think? This fucking snail. The, this honestly feels like a show by somebody who like had a, a a good idea and go on i'm interested to see uh, where this this sentence goes <laughs> yeah uh, yeah it it seems like it seems like someone's like first uh, r real solid attempt at storytelling you know what i mean how so like it seems like it seems like this is the first idea that that like this guy's like yeah i'm gonna do like he didn't like take the advice of other you know more established people who said like ev or what, who's the guy john romero who said like oh everybody's got like 15 shitty movies yeah in um, them I yeah it it, it seems movies. like that like somebody didn't take that advice and they just went with their first idea and made it do you know what I, you know what i mean uh, kinda, like, yeah. It's like they they have so many ideas in this, and the the actual like storytelling parts are like, yeah, okay, we're gonna sit around and talk, and then there's gonna be an action scene. Yeah. Interesting. And it's like it, they this. Yeah. So you're not enjoying it then? The last episode was the best one by far. Mm, I can agree with that. Yeah. Yeah, so, so I mean, I don't, I don't hate it, I don't hate it, but I'm, I'm like, it's, it's like, it's like average. What are we, are we on? Are we on five? Four, 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 four. This is four. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Um, so yeah. we are, we're a third of the way through the season. Yeah. And yeah, yeah. trust me, we haven't even gotten to the crazy shit yet. <laughs> I'll stick. I mean, I'll stick with it till the end. Fucking snails, man. This is why, kids. This is why you don't trust the French. Look, look, when snails come up to you offering a good deal about saving your friend from their existential crisis and suicidal thoughts, don't trust them. It's always a manipulation to get their sibling back. Always. Without <laughs> exception. Never trust a snail. Never trust uh, Never trust the French. That too. Never. Mostly snails. Ne never trust the French. They'll send you porn. <laughs> Or, or you know, uh, the wait, I, French. Uh, oh God. She, okay, so one of them, one of them is I don't, I, French. Okay, I was just thinking. Oh, you, you were gonna say Tom? I, I I'm trying to think of what what to talk about with this. So okay, so uh, there was a lot of information dumped on me at the end there. Yeah. Um. There, there is, there is a lot to uh, decompress in this episode with the. Yeah. They used to be human. Everything in this world used to be human. Or, I, mean, I guess everything humanoid used to be human. Why is the soul trying to kill the bone? It's not. They're trying to capture it. Oh. Like, that That, that was the yeah. big thing, is that, like, they mentioned earlier that, in the very first episode, that they captured gems. They, they captured the, 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 the gems to make them into jewelry. And, um... Like, my, my theory on the matter is that the Lunarians don't understand why they're doing what they're doing. Like, they don't have, like, the conscious thought. It's just some kind of instinct to gather gems and accessorize. But they... Aren't they the soul? Why would they not... Why would they be the ones that lack conscious thought? Um... I don't quite know yet. Um... It, 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 that that's just the running theory because we don't honestly learn that much about Lunarians. <laughs> uh, uh, we, th there, there's a lot we don't learn about right away. Um, like obviously in the manga, they've already gone pretty far. Uh, and I, I want to just correct myself earlier. I said the manga wasn't that great. Um, 
I don't read a lot of action-based manga, so when I see action stills from manga, uh, they don't impress me quite as much as actual animation. Typically, typically. That's fair. Um, so, yeah. like... I can't really be a comment of that, but the art is actually good in the manga. The art is, for the most part, good. It's usually the placement and flow that I have issue with because there's a lot of things you can't just follow that easily. Um, when I've seen scenes, <laughs> seen clips from it, or uh, clips, but pages from it. Um, so I just wanted to get that out of the way because I, I did, I think, misspeak when, when I talked about it. Um, but no, uh, the, there is a lot to decompress with that like a lot of philosophy uh, about what the nature of humanity is and and going into that um but mostly just the fucking twist that that they, they are human that there, there is there is sort of humans in this world it's our world and i thought it was interesting how they mentioned that the world waned five times and on the sixth is when humanity could no longer continue and i'm wondering what exactly that's referencing to like are we talking like world ending cataclysms like, are we talking, like, like immediate impact? Like, I'm wondering exactly what event led to humanity suddenly dissolving and becoming ghosts, fish people, and rocks. Because hmm. that, that's, like, that's like a later mystery I, that, that they don't keep, pick up in this season. Um, hmm. That's actually my main complaint with this season, and I don't really host it as much as a complaint because the story flows as it is, but there's no real through line to this season. There, There's not really a... Like, every... There, there are arcs. There are certain arcs, but there's no, like, major plot line that follows through it, aside from following Foss and following as she develops as a character. Um... That's the only major tethering thread throughout the, the, the series so far. Um, but aside from that, I mean, like, I, 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 I really enjoy this. Um, I, I think the scattered pace of it actually works in its favor, the scattered nature of it. Uh, mm. I feel free to disagree. I, I can understand mm. that can be annoying. Uh, the, the, the well, scattered, I mean, you're talking about more of the show than I've of, seen. So. The scattered pacing makes it kind of hard to, like, what am I trying to say? It's like when it's all over the place like that, it's hard to like kind of stay grounded. I guess is what I'm getting at. Well, like, it's hard I mean, to, like, I don't, I don't exactly agree. I mean, I mean, okay, the episode but... that was the farthest out of place was my favorite one. True, very true. <laughs> yeah, but like when you, when it, uh. it's lack of focus is really kind of the issue that I've had. I've been having this whole time pretty much with less with land illustrious well no i mean i don't i, I mean i don't even agree with that i, I don't i, I don't yeah. think it lacks focus I, I think it you know it uh uh not not it's not focus that it lacks it's it's momentum that too yeah, yeah. it's it yeah. seems like it's like it's just kind of like going like yeah. it's going really slow but then making these like big leaps it's like yeah. it's like you know how you got like a running start to a jump it's like these guys are like walking and then they just like long jump from a standing position. <laughs> yeah. It's like, oh yeah, I'm going to walk into the ocean to feed my fucking snail. Oh and... God, archers. <laughs> you know, I, I, I was actually thinking like she's underwater. There's probably at least, you know, there's no way the, the lunar people can get to her now. Oh, um, no, fuck you. Or fucking yeah, they, um... you, you could, you could fire, you could fire arrows underwater. Okay, to be fair, yeah, they're like ethereal sure. arrows, so I mean, I'm not sure how that works. Um, she got her fucking feet shot off. Yeah. How many times is this girl gonna get broken into pieces? Isn't her gimmick that she's like the second weakest one? Yeah, she is incredibly fragile. Yeah. Um, I mean, like a, a lot of the like a lot of the gimmicks are people losing limbs and shit. I mean, that was the best joke to me. Ah, my hand! Like that's literally a gag for them. Uh. <laughs> so like I don't know I, what they do with this because shit starts getting kind of real quite quickly um, do you guys remember one of the key things said about losing limbs um, it was something like uh, oh I remember it, but I'm having trouble, having trouble wording There's irony it right in this situation um, for anyone that, that remembers. 
Um, <laughs> yeah. Uh, no, okay. It's like they can't keep doing it. It's their. It's like because their limbs aren't actually their limbs. Yeah. So they're like. It's like a piece of themselves is breaking off. It's not like an expendable piece. It's just like a piece. All right. You'll 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 see you'll see how that that works more next episode. Yeah. It's because I I remember I was I was confused a couple episodes back when they like rebuilt her. And it's just like, wait a second, how do they know which pieces are which pieces? So I had, like, forgotten what they said, but now that you bring it up, it's like, oh, yeah, yeah, they were talking about that. The pieces aren't actually, they don't actually go in places. They're just all pieces. Yes. So you can, you yeah. can chisel them out down and make them fit, and then you have an adhesive that apparently just fuses they're, them together again. They're, 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 they're 100% made of stem cells. So, I mean, basically, they, they basically are. Um, like they, I think they explained that it was a microorganism that like absorbed rock, uh, uh, uh that helped form whole uh, 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 bodies. Um, you'll see more of that later on. They, 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 gems in this universe are fucking fascinating how they operate. I, 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 I want to keep talking about it, but I don't want to spoil anything because this is the All show right, gets well, wild. The show gets wild. Okay, uh, but we've been re- we'll, we'll get to it when we yeah, get. Yeah, we've to been it. recording yeah. for about an hour and thirty minutes. Any final thoughts before we move on to our next major recording session? Um, not in particular. No, no, no I like I the nothing. I like the OP. <laughs> yeah, the OP is great. <laughs> all righty, all righty. Uh, well, let's call it here. Um, <laughs> thank- wait, so wait, are we stopping recording and then going to another? Yeah, one? we're stopping recording. We're recording yeah, yeah, I would. Okay. It, is it? Are you able to do that, Tom? Because you're not using like oh, yeah. webcam. No, okay. no, no. I can just hit stop on my camera and then hit start again. Okay. All, all right. right. Good. Uh, well, yeah. thank you all very much for watching. Uh, we hope you enjoyed it. Shout out to all of our lovely patrons and everyone in our our patron mostly Discord. Um, yes. Pa- patron mostly is a good yeah, way to put patron it. mostly Discord. Patron mostly. Um, yeah. I guess uh, we'll catch you all in the next episodes. Catch you all on the flip side. Bye-bye.